tuned in to our once again and we're reporting live here in motion, precisely at our uh, Ogumokun. Uh, what I needed to draw your attention to is this Ogumokun street. And uh, at the tail end, you know, as you can see in the background, of Ogumokun linking to Agege Motor Road. You know, in the course of the, you know, the last rain that has started, I mean, like three days from now, you, you can see how, you know, the road has become. And, uh, and as a result of some of the things that, that we are being caused, you know, you know, with our activities, things like, you know, having to, you know, drink and drop uh, plastic bottles on the road and inside the, you know, the gutters, you know, where water is going to pass through and some of the things that, you know, as you can see here, all these things that are being placed on the you know, waterways, areas where water is meant to, you know, to pass through, but it has gradually become, you know, somewhere more pavement. Saying, and uh, I think we need to, you know, to, you know, to start up, you know, with things that we, you know, we should, we need to stop some of these things that we do that is really affecting our environment, most especially places where we stay. Because this road, you know, is meant to be for, it's supposed to be a motorable road, but the way, you know, and all the causes of some of the activities that we do as humans, it has really turned the road to something else, as you can see in the background. So we, my advice to each and every one of us living here in motion is, you know, to, you know, to change some of our ways and also to sensitize other people. But I'm sure not every one of us is, you know, doing some of these things, but it will do us to live, be, or can start, you know, campaigning, you know, a kind of a one-on-one -on -one thing how people can change their ways when it comes to environmental matters and I think this is the time we have to do it because basically I believe you know for a healthy environment is as a result of the people who are living there. That is all I have to say for you and I'm saying this because I'm a Mushan and I want Mushin to become great again. Mushin to the world giving life a meaning. Goodbye, God bless.